The Savior, our greatest exemplar, always faced his Father. He loved and served his fellow men, but said, I received not honor from men. He wanted those he taught to follow him, but he did not court their favor. When performing an act of charity such as healing the sick, the gift often came with the request to tell no man. In part, this was to avoid the very fame which followed him in spite of his efforts to eschew it. He condemned the Pharisees for doing good works only to be seen of men. The Savior, the only perfect being who ever lived, was the most fearless. In his life, he was con confronted by scores of accusers, but never yielded to their finger of scorn. He is the only person who never once forgot which way he faced. Quote, I do always those things that please the Father, and I seek not mine own will, but the will of the Father which hath sent me.